That ball's out. Picked up by the Saints and Jordan. And now they're saying incomplete pass. And they've blown it dead. Jordan's down the sideline, but Walt Anderson is saying incomplete pass, no fumble. During the break, they made the announcement that this ball was out. It's a fumble. It's not an incomplete pass. It didn't look like it was that close. And Mike Pereira, by saying incomplete pass, they blew it dead. Just a killer mistake that hurts the Saints so badly. When it's that close, you have to lean. To the air again goes Daniel. And the pass is going to be picked off, intercepted by Daryl Worley, who was just talking about roughing the passer. Defense number 73. Check it out from this angle. And that's what they're saying. If you put the, if you put the body into the player, if you take your body, drive him into the ground, I get that he's trying to get his hands out right there. It, it is such... I, I know they're trying to get that out. I don't like... <laughs> Penalty flag on the play as Elliott gets the first down. Trippin offense, number 72. Could be a killer. I don't like that call anymore, and I like the other one they had for trip too. They bring four, quickly getting it to the running back, who loses control of the ball that time. Carry on Johnson. If you take a look at it, let's three, see. Three steps down with Ruling possession. Play, but there was a reception. The receiver forward the ball forward, fumbled the ball forward out of bounds. We'll bring it back to the spot of the fumble, which the yardage gain is enough for a first step. After review of the play, it is an incomplete pass as the receiver never gained control of the ball. We fourth down at the previous spot. Green Bay will not be charged with a timeout. The practice squad as well. Third down and ten for Rodgers. <gasps> Running out of options and then going down, and a flag comes down at the end there. Illegal use of hands, hands to the face, defense, number 90. Five-yard penalty from the previous spot. First down, Green Bay. That's a first down for Green Bay. They were just saved. Let's take a look at number 90, Trey Flowers, and watch where he puts his hands and see if he gets him to the face there. Right now, he's on the shoulder pad. He's still on the shoulder pad. I'm trying to figure out when does he actually put hands to the face there? I got a, I got a shoulder pad, John Perry. Book, you're right. I think we get fooled there based on where the hand is on the upper part of the chest rather than the neck or the mask. And that's why you see Trey Flowers. He is so upset because he knows his hand was not on the face mask and the referee, Cleet Blakeman, they got fooled there. I mean, that goes from a sack to a first down. Here's third and four with Rodgers. Calmly retreating, looking for something. Flag is down as he throws to the end zone incomplete illegal use of hands hands to the face defense number 90 five yard penalty from the previous spot first down green bay and that's a dagger for matt patricia and company let's take a look at number 90 trey flowers and see if this is indeed illegal hands to the face Really see it from that angle. It's going to come late. Here it comes towards there. It is coming there. But uh, again, where? That's he's on the left shoulder once yeah, again. Uh, We're again. On the left shoulder. That, is Bakhtiari selling that by arching back his but, head? But again, that is a terrible call. That's twice on Trey Flowers in crucial situations that the refs have blown the call. And now Green Bay will use the timeout. John Perry, chime in here. What do you see? Let, let's see if we can find something in the neck, because keep in mind it's neck or face mask. But, Booger, I do agree based on what we've seen so far. It does look like he's on the shoulder pad yeah. rather than the neck. Yeah, he's nowhere near. His, he, he's on the shoulder pad, and Trey Flowers is so strong, he's pressing Bakhtiara back. That, that's a bad call. That can't happen. Five yards and a first down. It's the game. It seals the game. No timeouts for Detroit. Yeah. I'm with you there. That's why I said it was the dagger. Or long this summer and now to play hero again and there it is walk it off and win it for mason crosby receiver on the outside watson getting out of the pocket looks downfield uncorks a deep one 
Incomplete. DeAndre Hopkins wants a flag. Uh, he should get one because Humphrey grabbed him just as the ball was coming, and Hopkins had his eyes on the ball. He was going to make this catch in the back of the end. So watch the grab here. Little tur jersey tug there, and there's the contact before the ball gets there. This is worth a challenge. And that's exactly what's going to happen here with 5.45 to play in the first. After review, the ruling on the field stands. Houston is charged with their first time out, and they've lost their first challenge of the game. Please reset the game clock to 5.46. And there's contact with the jersey. That's pass interference to begin with. And then the bump there, the grab here, then comes the ball. Check, 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 pass interference. Five from the nine. Darnold under pressure and going down at the 20 and there's Max Crosby and a flag comes flying in Personal foul roughing the passer defense. Well Crosby is going to be lined up to the outside He's going to be the one that beats beats him around the corner and ultimately gets the sack on Darnold I didn't see that Ooh. I didn't see the roughing the passer. I don't know maybe who they call it on Hurst? Hurst, the second man in on the field. They've run the ball. It's been tough sledding. See if they can't get something going. Play action here, and Wilson just gets rid of it. And they're going to throw a flag on Clay Matthews for the hit on Wilson. Matthews is pleading his case. He was doing so before the flag was thrown to the Seattle sideline, saying, I hit him with my shoulder, and I hit him in his shoulder. I don't like the call at all. I don't like this call at all. Well, they're getting together. I wonder if they pick it up. They were trying to take a shot down the field. Personal foul. Roughing the passer on the defense number 52. 15-yard penalty. Automatic first down. Yeah, the, like you said, the officials right there watching the whole thing. And yeah, just those those calls. And he's trying to explain, hey, it was shoulder and and Hey, those calls wins and they lose games. And T.Y. Hilton going to come down and make the pick right there. If it's within one yard of the line of scrimmage, it's legal. Oh boy, Terry way in on that oh, one. Oh boy. Yeah. Not only is it not more than a yard, he just sits there and the defender contacts him first. You I don't see the... any no, offensive no. pass. First from. So it's just an interesting way it turned out. And time running out, but Trubisky completes the pass to Burton, who runs out of bounds in a hurry. Personal foul, roughing the passer, defense. Number 55. Just like contact, out of a contact sport. And that... We got an update for you on the uh, Lions and Eagles. The kickoff return after the Lions field goal. Miles Sa Oh, boy. Gets his helmet ripped off. But watch the slow-mo replay here, gang. We're going to give you an end zone angle of it. Miles Sanders. Oh. Now, oh. Thankfully, it popped off there. Could have caused an injury. Sanders looked okay, all things considered. Pain is falling again. The wind is up again. Minshew keeps. Throws. Play not there. But a flag where Minshew went down as Marquise Lee was the target. Here's the call. Personal foul, roughing the passer, defense number 44, 15-yard penalty, automatic, first down. Kamale Correa is guilty of Minshew to the ground. I don't like the call. It looked like he came in with his shoulder. He didn't, you know, the, the helmet comes down somewhat, but the contact is shoulder to shoulder, and I thought it was pretty good. 